Hi guys. Today I'm gonna be showing how to get Rocket Dock for your computer. Now in this tutorial, first we have to go to RocketDock.com, and you can download the latest version. As it is, please note that Windows XP is only for 64-bit versions, and Windows Vista 64-bit versions, Windows 7 64-bit versions, and all editions. Editions. So, first of all, we're going to install Rocket Dock. Let me just click this. As you can see, you can just click the download button right here. Right now, just wait a few seconds for it to load and um, rock it up. This should come up. Now we just click allow. And we just wait a few seconds. You just click OK English. Next, I accept. Install. Create desktop. Create desktop icon and next install. Once you've finished installing it, you'll get this icon over right here. And if you click, when I click it, this should pop up. And there you go. You get Rocket Dock for Windows Vista. It's kind of like a dock bar, and you can click icon settings or dock settings. And you can click around at startup or icons or style. So you can change the the way it looks, you see, you can change the way it looks. It's quite, it's quite nice. See, if you were to just zoom in, you get this effect. You know, it's quite cool to get this. So, so I would definitely choose um, kind of a proto glass. Or something. Yeah, this looks nice. Now, what we don't have is we don't have this stack documents. We only have clock docklets. Stack docklets gives you this effect. I don't know. It seems kind of cool. So if you want this effect, all you have to do is turn the clock. It should not. Should not be more. I think it's quite like that room. Just click the save icon and save. Now you just have to wait for it to download. As it's done. Alright, yeah, it's done. And, and don't worry, if, if this seems to be blocking you, it's okay. You can just click auto height. I'll go away. So, how we do this? Okay, first of all, you better be extra careful. You want to scan it. So, I rather scan it and protect it. Alright. Now we go to computer. My computer XP, and then we go to our operating system partition. We go to Windows. Actually, no, sorry. Sorry, we go to program files and then we just look for Rocket Dock. Rocket Dock. And then you go to Documents. As you can see, it's quite simple. Open the file. C Stack Documents. Just take that file and put it here. And you can continue. You need to be administrator to do all this. I hope you are. Well, yeah, that's about it. And. Now all we have to do is this. Go here and click add item stack document. And this is over here. It's quite simple, right? So then you just click icon settings and the folder that you want to put. So I put my documents folder and you can select the icon that you want to put. Yeah, and I would want to put this Columbia. Alright, so then you can select the name, but I already don't touch that, so I just go to plan. Now, this is the difference, so we click OK. And as we go and see the icons over there, and then click. Ta da! You get it. You get contacts. When you open contacts, you get contacts. You go up there again, you click favorites, and voila, you get favorites. So it's quite simple and quite easy. And if you want to see the grid, it's quite grid. It's quite nice also. Just click it and you get this this effect. I'm not so sure what automatic means, but automatic I'm not so sure about it. Let's try it. Automatic right automatic automatic seems I don't know, I guess it's some extra feature or something, right? Alright. So thank you for watching this tutorial. 
I hope you enjoy the video. Please rate and subscribe. Thank you.